Bonaboy is the most influential young Nigerian for the year 2019. Bonaboy defeated Tenny in a ranking poll collected by the firm. So, yeah, I guess the accolades continues. Mm. And congratulations to him. Do you uh, think he should have won it over Tenny? Of course, with the whole Grammy thing going on and all of that, so I believe that um, it's fair enough for you to get it because um, Tennis wasn't recognized by the Grammys, and um, he's done a lot of other like the Jimmy Fallon show and all of that. So I believe right now he's getting more pay, more endorsements than Tenny, even though Tenny is doing. Don't get me wrong, Tenny is doing equally very good, but I'm talking about with the international recognition going for him right now. I think it's fair that he only. I, th I think for me, I just wanted to know what they mean by influence. The criteria. Thank you. That was like, what I was yeah, going to because Other people that have won are people like Funke Akindele, yeah. David Doe, uh, Moses, Victor Moses. Yo, Victor Moses. I need to know what, what okay. this influence let is me, about. What me, are they okay. influencing? For Bonaboy, I, I can know. say he influ he's influencing the Afro pop vibe and yeah. or is it Afro beats vibe and culture across the country, across um, the world, yeah. right? So maybe, maybe they need to start breaking down this yeah. influence. I like to put it away from the music now i don't know about um tennis tweet so much because um i don't follow her on twitter mm -hmm. but um i definitely fo follow bonaboy and i see how many retweets he get so i'm looking about the influences it's about retweet now normally gets more retweets oh yeah yeah no no i want to just like, like that even get away just saying, let's put it away from the music now okay. now who's going to put out a social issue tweet i will get a lot of retweets do you understand that people would actually, who is actually going to speak about um, a social issue and people would even want to listen? So I can count 10. I can count yeah, 10. I mean, Don Jazzy did it. And, and I mean, he was, he's doing it constantly. Yeah. Like I mentioned, normally tweet blows up. Zlatan doesn't even have millions okay. of followers, but once he tweets, it's, it's, yeah. it blows up. So it's mm. not, I don't think a tweet is what they use now. But mm. like she rightly said, maybe they really should break down what this influence yeah. means to them. Because yes. when I first thought it was about being a musician, mm -hmm. but then I know this is Victor Moses, who's mm -hmm. not even in the entertainment scene. So it just makes me wonder, like, what exactly is your... Um, Maybe you the know, people that can walk into certain rooms. What kind of rooms? Like, um, I believe um, a Bonner boy right now would be able to walk into the Grammy room, walk into the Grammy Academy room. He would yeah. probably be able to walk into the... Yeah, you see, those are also limited spaces, except it's what you were, um, you were saying, Elsie, about, like... If it's not about his music, or was it you who was mentioning that? Mm -hmm. If it's not about his music and when, where it's taking him to, I don't see any other influence. I don't really, I wouldn't even call him an activist of any social issue. Mm -hmm. And to be honest with you, I love Bernard Boy's music. Everybody knows that. But his person, when it comes to actually talking online, most of the time he talks crap. Mm -hmm. That's the reason why he, he has to be talking, The only vocal from, time from we Instagram. even had to discuss was the xenophobic time yeah. when he went against AK yeah. and all that. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, and that, even that had become a serious issue in mm -hmm. South Africa. Um, so when it comes to social issues i don't absolutely think it's influencing anything i don't think i think there's many more celebrities who have handled themselves mm -hmm. a lot better a lot more mature and have created influential positive things i can't really put mm. Bernard boy in that section no, but if it's about his music yeah, music yeah sure for bits yeah lifestyle pop mm -hmm. culture something mm -hmm. like that well i think like you both <laughs> rightly said i think they need to break down what makes them influential mm -hmm. what gives them this um edge and also a it's a media company like mm -hmm. okay no offense. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. So a lot of people are sucking up to this artist right now, like yeah. trying to get in their good books.